What's up, YouTube? Rex back again, and on my I'm on my deload week, which means that I'm not really gonna post any videos. So I thought I'd post a um, short little video on what's in my gym bag, and I have a little Puma gym bag from Ross, which is the poor man's poor man's Gucci store for swag and for anything else. So first thing in my gym bag. I'm going from top to bottom. Nike Romaleos. Best lifting shoes I've ever had. You might be wondering why I have these. These are squat shoes with the raised heel, extra stability. You might be like, why don't you use free runs or any other thing? Because free runs don't have much stability and this sole is rock solid. But anyways, um, I always have a pair of shoes, whether they be Chucks or my uh, Romaleos, because I squat and deadlift on the same day. So I gotta have those essentials. Next, I got some um, Toro. Uh, let's see if I can find the logo. Here it is. Toro leather lifting straps these are the best ones because the leather a little exclusive and also because they have left and right for idiots who don't know you straps regardless you don't really need to have left or right because i always use this one on my left one left one on my right one because it really doesn't matter but anyways that's pretty cool um, plus these are really durable compared to the nylon ones or whatever they're made out of cloth whatever so got that by the way I got those off of the Toro or no the uh, Titan Titans uh, website if you guys want to buy those next thing I have for squatties and or deadlifts to protect my shins you got some Ray-Ban knee sleeves, which I will have a review on. Um, yeah, I got a small because I'm small. But uh, I'm thinking about getting SBD knee sleeves, since that's what all the cool kids have. Just kidding. But um, next I have this yellow resistance band thingy. I use it for mobility-wise, before benching, like warm-ups. Rotator cuff warm ups. You can get this shit from uh, anywhere, really. You can get it from trash can. Neighbor's trash can. And next, I got a Wonder Bread sandwich. Just kidding. But uh, people, you might, you guys might think, is this your pre or post workout? Bleh. Pre or post workout. Sorry. Sound like Michael Reader there. But um, nah, this is actually where I have all my crack cocaine, my Molly. And, nah, these are just ammonia, uh, what's it called, ammonia caps for when you need that little boost, which I don't, I only use these like twice in the gym, um, but uh, yeah, buy these if you want to get stared at in the gym, and if you want people to look at you funny, well you're getting a hella high, uh, little pump, or boost from, uh, the ammonia. Shouldn't I nose. But anyways, next thing, Titan signature gold wrist straps. These are the best wrist straps I've ever used, simply because the only other wrist straps I've used were the chic ones, which suck. And I like these because I got these are a little short because I got used to them. These are like 16 or 18 inches, but I think I'm gonna go with some gangster wraps soon. But I like these. I only bought these honestly because they look cool, and I I always use these now for. Uh, I never use them a lot until I start low bar squatting, so I use these like almost every session. But uh, they still give you pretty good hella support, as you can see, regular and Titan. I just wish I got these a little longer, like the 24 inches. 
Um, but yeah, I might end up getting some mini gangster wraps because I really don't know what to do with 36 inch uh, long wrist wraps. Next, I got some me electronics headphones, backup headphones. Shout out to Brandon Campbell, OG headphones from him. And I got, uh, what else do I got? I got some, I got some pocket change, because I'm poor. Nah, but for real, I use these on this baby. Granddaddy, master of powerlifting. An Inzer 10mm Forever Lover Belt. Because, fuck prongs. And um, I use the coins because some days I feel a little fat and some days I feel a little skinny and small. <laughs> That's what she said. But I use these to adjust the uh, little screws here. Put it one down and one up. So it prevents me from have to bring, having to bring a screwdriver to the gym and look like a mechanic when I'm there to lift. Next, second to last thing I got, a Kinevo pouch. From when I used to use Kinevo headphones. Just too lazy to bring them in. And I'm too lazy to charge them, by the way. That's the only reason. And the last thing, chalk. If you're a true lifter, you gotta have chalk, man. Fuck straps, for real. Only if your grip give out or if you have baby hands like max tuning that rip a lot and tear easily. But um yeah. Go to the gym, get some chalk, do this before every lift, before every of your lifts, and comment back if you got kicked out or not. But anyways, that was that's all that's in my gym bag, and I want you guys to respond to my video. What's in show me what's in your gym bag, and here's a little clip of what's in all my gym bag. So I deserve a video since you guys have to make me clean this shit up. Nah, no, I'm just joking, but hit me up with a comment, rate, or subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace, guys.